guys, what's going on? It's B-Man the Champ here, and I'm out here in Mississauga to visit Paranormal Cirque, which is supposedly a horror circus. First time I've ever been to one of those. And look at this thing, this is a trailer outside. Got a bunch of skeletons. And this is freaking hilarious. You got the sex motor. <laughs> I don't know if this is going on YouTube, but <laughs> here it is. So, um, I don't know what I'm exactly what I'm allowed to film, so I might just, this might just be a review after, we'll see, but, uh, let's see what happens. So this is just as I come inside, apparently there's a maze you gotta go through before you get in, which is cool. We got, the uh, snack bar, obviously, souvenir shop. I don't know what they have. What's that actually? See what's over here. I think it's more or less the same stuff. Oh, you got people trying to scare you as you come in. This is great. I'm really glad I decided to come for this. favorite horror villain of all time. Boy the puppet, aka Jigsaw. So we're just entering the tent now, the main area. Probably just gonna give a review after, but so far I'm really liking what I see so far. It's awesome. Alright, we'll see you after the show, guys. Sorry, just one last thing before the... I gotta give a huge shout out to to my boy John, these seats are fucking amazing. Literally, right in front of the stage. That is insane. It's so it's gonna be awesome. I can already tell. Hey guys, so we're about the halfway point. It's just intermission, and uh, I just thought I'd come out here and talk about what happened so far. Nothing really scary per se. Not like. Uh, any horror related stuff although the, the acrobatic stuff was really impressive a lot of it was really good and there was this one part where this guy was on a motorcycle was going across the tightrope with this woman and they were doing she was doing her thing and then they flipped the motorcycle 360 that was crazy a lot of fun so far I gotta say and there's <laughs> this one part I don't know if uh, you guys saw earlier at the beginning there's a guy with the chainsaw the half white face he was doing some stuff during the show freaking funny he was doing a knife throwing bit it was really funny it was a lot of so fucking good anyway so far i'm really liking it i'm really glad i came here and uh just uh, keep an eye out for a review later on guys well and there you have it the show is over it's a much shorter second half than the first i tell you what was like maybe what half an hour but check out the merch but what a what a second half it was, man! They had uh, some magic tricks, obviously, and they had um, what do you call it uh, had some really nice uh, dancers and stuff. And then of course they had the Wheel of Death. Is what the, I'm pretty sure what they call it is like the main event kind of thing. It was a lot of fun, though. I definitely recommend checking it out. Uh, they said they're going to be in Thornhill. I think they said September 26. So if you guys want to check that out you can do that um honestly i'd give the show probably hmm, i give it like an eight out of ten it was a really fun show really fun show what do you guys think of it oh i enjoyed it uh the second half was much weaker but it was still good well, that's shorter that's for it was sure weaker. yeah it was shorter and weaker but it was still good i know i yeah. really enjoyed it what do you think same thing i would probably give it an eight out of ten but yeah um, second half was, like, was a little bit weaker, yeah. But, but yeah. 
Yeah, it was a really good time though. Like I said, 8 out of 10, check it out. A lot of fun, I really liked the second half too. The first half was great. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to say. So uh, thanks for watching this guys, and I'll see you again in a couple of weeks for a Halloween haunt.